morning I booked a flight for tomorrow morning. I was gonna wake up at like 6 a.m. Get back into town. My family wants to have like this get together lunch thing. And so like I have to be there on time. It's very important. My mom's gonna be mad if I don't make it because she's the one organizing it. So I'm like, whatever, I'll leave at like 6 a.m. We'll get there at 11. We'll be fine, right? She calls me, she's like, Monica, that is not enough time. You need to catch a flight tonight. <sighs> it's just really frustrating because I have a lot of filming I need to do, whatever. So she's like, get on a midnight flight. I'm like, mom, I don't think they even have those. She's like, yes, they do. So I looked it up. They have a flight that leaves at 11.45 p.m., gets in at 2.30 a.m. And guess who rebooked their flight for that? Me. So that's going to be really fun. Not. At least I don't have to wake up early now. Good morning. It's 4 a.m. Packing up all my stuff and going to the airport. Yeah, so I ended up missing that midnight flight and had to rebook one for 7 a.m. So here I am waking up at 4 a.m. Good one, Monica. Really, really nice. It's painful to be awake, but I'm actually dealing with it better than I thought. Okay. Let's go. <laughs> I booked my flight for 7.20 p.m. Not a.m. Uber to the airport at 4 a.m. $12.66. Tall non-fat latte. $3.25. One checked bag, $25. Getting to the airport and realizing you actually booked your flight for 7 p.m., not 7 a.m., priceless. Actually, the price is $25 because they rebooked it, luckily. <laughs> I go to the kiosk, I'm like, can I get on an earlier flight? And they're like, the only one we have is till 1 p.m. Yeah, unfortunately, I don't have. And I need to be in Seattle at 11 a.m. or my mom's gonna be like so mad at me and just like never forgive me to be honest. So then she's like, wait, we actually have one more seat on the 6 a.m. Oh, you know what? I have seats available on the 6 a.m. Okay. and at 9, it is $25. Okay, I'll do that. Wait, wait. It's boarding in five minutes. <sighs> I haven't gotten through security or anything. I'm like, okay, let's just try that. Sure, whatever. I get through security in five minutes. I'm at the gate now. I'm okay. I'm gonna make it. Taxi out and take off. Again, Alaska Airlines the service too. Thought it was gonna be a really bad situation, but I'm actually totally fine. If I could break all the fast clocks, wouldn't make all the noise stop. Could we be still for a while? It was a long morning, but I did it. I made it home. Before 11 a.m. Yeah, and then also it would have, like, one. Mm -hmm. Um, you're a little late. No, I'm not. I'm not late. <laughs> Your eyes look a little tired. Do you want a piece of uh, toast? And yes, I'm down? so hungry. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've been just staring at this menu like, oh, I can't decide what I want. And my mom goes, you get a little bit of everything. Show them the, um, show them the menu. I did. It's a four course breakfast. She has no idea what courses are. I did. <laughs> I'm not fancy. Oh. I'm suddenly beginning to realize why it was so important that I came. Because of the food? <laughs> I'll get the country breakfast. Okay, these would be like orange. <laughs> I didn't realize this is gonna turn into a mukbang video. We get pastries. I'm out of work. You guys, Monica is like, she's here, but she's not really here. Like, she's sitting here, like, like you're not getting chances because, like, are you okay? Do it your way. Gosh. She's acting awake in this vlog, but then she basically just goes back to this. It's been real. 
Also, it looks very pretty out here. Older, because they're all little kids, but 